Holy crap, what's good, you two? It's your boy Bugs back, and guys, I got another great video for you today. And guys, before I get into it, we got a giveaway winner. And guys, Dominic McGilmore, you are the winner. Hit up my DMs. Guys, we are doing another giveaway on this one. Video's got to hit 50 likes on this one for another 10K in the comments. Yes, Dominic McGilmore, you have won. Hit me up in my whatever DMs, YouTube, whatever. I'll give you your 10K. Guys, the support has been unreal. And guys, before I get to the video, for all you saying that the market didn't crash, it's hilarious because, because I'm going to show you how many stubs I made and that you guys are crazy because the market crashed like crazy on Friday and Saturday. So we're going to get into it, how many stubs I made. And we're going to start off with just saying that I've made probably about 50,000 stubs easily off this. You guys don't have to believe me, but I'm going to show you in this video. I'm going to show you how much MT I made. So I'm not lying. And the market did crash. And I'm going to show you why. Okay. So let's get into it. We're going to start off with freaking Machado because right off the bat, I made so many stubs off Machado. Let's get to him. So, for all you guys saying the market didn't crash, I'm going to show you right now. Okay, so Manny Machado, let's get to him. Okay, first, right off the bat, we got Josh Hatter, okay? Josh Hatter, where is he? So my Miggy. Okay, Josh Hatter, I got him for 18K, 24K. That's 4K stubs profit just off Hatter, okay? 4K stubs there. Okay. So let's keep going. I'm going to show you the Machado. Okay. Machado is retardedly cheap, bro. I got him for 40, 38K, I think 39K. Look at his price. 52K. Guys, what is that? I, I'm sorry. My math is trash. I got 9K, 8K stubs off the Machado. So, okay. I wonder why that was, uh, I wonder why, how much I made. Look at that. I actually made so much money. Let me find it on here. Machado. Machado right here, 40K, 52K with the reduction, I'll make 7K stubs, okay? That's already 11K made right there from the market crash. So 11K made, let's keep going. Okay, JD Martinez, I got two of them for 18K. Let's go check it out. Let's, oh, I typed it in wrong, crap. Martinez. Let's check Martinez's price. Oh, he's at 26K. That's another four, 6K stubs made off both of them. So, okay, 6K stubs. We're already at 21K stubs made. Isn't that crazy? The market didn't crash. Look at that. 21K stubs made off my freaking methods. All right, let's keep going. So, I picked up, let's see, what else do we get? We got Staten. We got Staten for 27K. I don't know if he went up that much. We're about to go check. Oh, crap. Where is it? All right. So we got Staten for around 27K. Staten. Staten, Staten, whatever. Alrighty. And oh, he actually went down. He is because his inside edge is down. I'm just gonna keep him for now. His inside edge is down. That sucks. Okay. One person I did not make stubs off is Giancarlo Stanton. Whatever. Okay. There's another one I made stubs off. Where is it? You can make the stubs usually if their inside edge is down and their edge goes up you make a whole crap ton of stubs oh my god who else did i get okay edwin diaz i got him for 18k 22k that's 2k stubs profit that's not the biggest amount but his price is going up as the days goes on as the day go on let's keep going so john carl stein is the only one i did not make stubs off so far because the inside edge is down well, let's keep going. Okay, Blake Snell. I bought eight of these for 5K sell now. Now he's 9K. 3 3K stubs each. 3K times eight. 24K made. Guys, I made 24K off Blake Snell. If you don't believe me, I don't care. I'm just going to show you if I can find it. Okay, Blake Snell, 6K, 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 6K. So I made about 2,500 stubs off each of them that adds up big time i had eight i had eight of them i sold a lot of them because he went up to 9k i still have three so with that said i made over 40k stubs already and we didn't even stop i also got okuda for about 7k i'm, I'm not gonna make that many stubs i'm holding on to him till he's a diamond another great card okay guys also 
all the freaking golds in the game were 1k okay for instance let's go to whip merrifield let's see if his price went up i picked up a couple of him whip merrifield okay he's 1900 let's see how many i picked up of him i'm pretty sure i got a crap ton of whip merrifields for really cheap okay also rizzo was 1k i don't know if he went up but i got a crap ton of uh, whip merrifields for about 1200 so 1900 how many do i have in my i have five of them i got him for about 1200 and he's 1900 i'm gonna make another like 3k stubs after the reduction of those so i made about 50k already so guys you could say the market did crash i don't care i'm just showing you my results after friday i made i invested this many players on friday and it went perfect it actually went perfect i'm gonna make over 50,000 stubs on the market crash oh and i didn't even stop how much is rizzo Rizzo's 1400. I have two of them. I should have picked up more. I got him for quick sell price at a thousand. His price keeps going up. If he goes up to 1600, I'll make 500 stubs off each. It adds up. Guys, when the market crashes on Friday, all you have to do is pick up as many gold as possible and you will make so many stubs. I'm telling you. You don't have to believe me, but my video, my last video blew up. It's almost at a K views and it has 51 likes. So clearly, people know what I'm saying. So let's keep going. Oh, Andrew Miller. I got Andrew Miller for 19K. He's 26K. Guys, that's another 5K profit after reduction. It's a no brainer. Guys, I'm telling you. I got him for 18K. He's literally in the Cardinals collection. He's the only player in the Cardinals collection. I got him for so cheap. 19K. I'm over 50K stubs made already, guys. Over 50K stubs made already. It's unbelievable. We got Carrasco. We got Carrasco for out 12. He's 18. On the roster update, it was crazy. Got one Trey Turner. He wasn't that expensive. Guys, and also, I said hold on to Bellinger. Bellinger was about 8K during the crash. He's at 10-7. He went up. I have Bellinger as well, my team. I picked up so many players. Lorenzo Kane didn't go up that much. He probably will. 1,500. Okay. He was literally quick sell value. Another one that you can make mad stubs off. So literally, all you have to do for people with low stubs, just buy as many goals as possible. Oh, another one. Trevor Bauer. His sell now is 2,500. I have six of him. He's 40, he's 4,100 now. You picked him up for 25. You're making a thousand off each. And not only that, he might go diamond. So I'm keeping on to him. I'm holding on to him. He's got six more. Yeah, I got six of him. I'm holding on to him. He's going to go diamond this year. He's pitching gems. Trevor Story was cheap. Let's see if I can find that. Trevor Story is about 2K. Crap, where is he? Oh my god. All right, whatever. You don't have to believe me, but Trevor Story, I got a bunch of him for about 2100. He's now 3200. All right. Corey Seager, he was freaking quick sell value. He's 1400. I think he's going to go up. I have 3 of him. So everyone, a lot of the golds, a lot of the high golds were quick sell value. What that that's crazy. If you don't pick up the golds on a market crash for quick sell value, you're insane. They're going to go up. Whit Merrifield could be a diamond. He's playing amazing. So guys, also when the market crashes and guys with inside edge uh, are down and they're diamond, pick them up. You will literally make double the stubs. I'm not even kidding. That's what I did with JD Martinez and Machado. Machado's edge was down. I'm going to make 9K stubs or 8K stubs off Machado too. So guys, okay. It's freaking crazy how people are saying the market didn't crash. I find that insane because the market straight up crashed. And I'm showing you how many stubs I made. I made over... 50k maybe 60k off this freaking market crash and it's so easy you literally just sell now players you just buy sell now so if you don't know how to do this if you guys are new to the game you just go create buy order do this and it pops up on sell now and that's every friday but also i have many other stub making method videos if you guys want to watch those there's another there's a lot of stub method videos for, for, for my channel they all help people out a lot but guys if you guys enjoyed this video, please just drop a like and sub if you're new. Guys, it would help me a lot. Let's let's get the video up, man. Sub if you're new, bro. The support has been unbelievable. And I'm just going to show you my team before the video ends. Um, the team stacked, and I made so many stubs. Oh, and I got Ryan Braun for cheap, too. My team is beautiful. I got Ken Griffey. I got McCann. Guys, all these golds. Oh, and I also picked up a bunch of Aldrington Simmons. Because I think he's going to go diamond again. He's playing amazing. I got all these golds for quick sell value. They're all going up in price still. You don't have to believe me. I don't care. I know what I'm doing. I've been doing this forever. I've been doing this for about three years on Dynasty. Now that I'm a YouTuber, I'm showing you my methods and what I do on market crashes. 
And this is exactly what I do. I have like six Mitch Hanniger. I have seven Mitch Hanigers. So guys. Also, I'll pick up Mitch Hanniger. His quick sell value is crazy. He was at quick sell value. He's literally a top five player right now in baseball. It's unbelievable. You should pick him up. But guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video once again. And that's all I got for you today. Stay blessed. Sub if you're new. And guys, that's all I got for you. Peace! Hey, yo,